So I had a couple emails from people asking where to post for attendance and all that. So I'm at Moodle. I'm at the Moodle course site. And what I want you to see is here's this week zero and this is the introduction form is right here and that you know for, for this first couple of days you so I'll post you know I, you know follow the directions there that that'll count as an attendance point for week one okay the other aspect of, of this is if you scroll down I'm gonna get that video out of the way what I do each week is I have I'll say like week one and I'll say when it ends and you see these bars here that tells you the current week I'll leave the past weeks open above this and then in order to access the materials for that week you just click on the click on the name okay and then you come down you'll see the work for the week I'll usually have a quiz there and as I said there's no no work here and then here's the sections recovering you can also find this in the semester outline and this is link this is a link right here if you uh, if you if you click on that you'll see that it takes you to the semester outline it has a whole week all the weeks lined out when the tests are going to happen and it's not super detailed like I do each week but at least it'll give you a general outline okay so you want to read through the book and then and then sometimes I'll post some videos of people as giving people in the past or if you ask you need some help we're walking through something I'll do that during the week um, then you want to do this my open math work that's where there's a lot of video out there and a lot of exercises and that's worth 10 points each week the weeks the week sections okay and you can I can show you I think I already did a video on how to register for that okay and then here's where the attendance happens and I'll usually put it down put down what you're what you're going to do is generally it is the same format. You're going to, you know, you can ask questions, answer questions. Uh, it can be about material, uh, it's about what to do of the week. I mean, if you have any questions about that, feel free. And I don't really specify too much. This discussion forum here is like for general questions or, or that kind of thing. And this form I try to reserve for these going to the board questions where you're going to work out your answer to a to an, to an even numbered exercise and it's good to do the even numbered exercises because you don't have the answers to those and it puts a little bit of authenticity into your work okay and yeah I don't mark you right or wrong I just want you to show, show the work okay and what you do is if you needed to show uh, some of you a little lost maybe with Moodle still you can click on the link to that you have this you can add a new discussion topic and you can you can give it whatever subject subject you want. And I'll just post that. If you want to do an attachment, you can do that here. Um, people like to often will show their work on paper and then scan it or take a nice clear snapshot of it, get it on their computer, and then then upload it. And then you can post it to your forum. And then there's the post. And if you want to reply to what somebody wrote, you wrote reply and so forth. Okay, so that's how you earn your attendance points is by posting here in the Moodle form. Now, out in my open math, I logged in there all previously. Um, they do have these forms. I, I tend not to use them. I tend not to go look at those. So I, would, I wouldn't recommend that you do them. Um, here's some general course information that will always be there. I try to repeat kind of what I'm doing in Moodle. There's a semester outline again, and then some other things, and that's some other open source information. And this is some some boilerplate from my open math. This is a copy of the online textbook here. Um, these are errors in the textbook. I haven't found many, but I'm sure there's some. Okay, then you can navigate to uh, this is that how to this is this assessment isn't really marked right or wrong but it'll teach you how to enter numbers into my open math online math can be a pain uh, this will just get you a little practice on how to do that um, one thing I want to make sure you see is you see this little yellow arrow if you click a, that'll give you a little more math option so that'll let you type in an equation you can also do the shortcuts with the dividing uh, it'll come in more useful when we're starting to do logarithms and then maybe some trig okay um, and that's that and then when the actual coursework here's week one you do the drop down and 
and here's the le learning targets and the obje objectives for this section and then here's the homework you're going to work on and you should really do this after you've skimmed through the textbook um, a lot often, often they'll have a video with it like with this this homework assignment there's a couple of different videos you can watch if you don't know what you're doing with it okay um, and that's that I mean there is another some other features I'll include later on but I don't want to overwhelm you okay so most of the course the main course is here in Moodle um, and then the my open math is where you're gonna get some practice learning the math okay I hope that answers okay I hope that answers